now let's move on to interacting system so let us consider a two tank interacting system having an inlet flow rate q of t with a height h1 and a resistance r1 and with outlet flow rate q1 it is connected to another tank and the outlet flow rate is q2 with r2 resistance and the height of the i h2 let h1 is greater than h2 so q1 is equal to h1 minus h2 by r1 here the second second tank level h2 always tries to put the pressure on the tank h1 it always chokes the tank 1 so this makes the response more sluggish than an on interacting system so interacting system uh, is more sluggish compared to non interacting system q2 is h2 by r2 here q1 is dependent on h1 and h2 and height h1 is greater than h2 it is h1 minus h2 suppose the height h2 is greater than h1 then q1 will be equal to h2 minus h1 by r1 you can do in any manner so i am considering the flow in this way let us consider the mass balance for first tank so inlet flow rate q of t minus q1 is equal to accumulation a1 dh1 by dt density is cancelled out q of t minus the outlet flow rate q1 is equal to h1 minus h2 by r1 is equal to a1 dh1 by dt so let us take as equation 1 now consider the tank 2 so writing the material balance inlet flow rate q1 minus outlet q2 is equal to the accumulation a2 dh2 by dt q1 is h1 minus h2 by r1 minus q2 is h2 by r2 is equal to a2 dh2 by dt so at steady state hs h1 of s minus h2 of s by r1 minus h2 of s by r2 is equal to 0 so take the difference between these two equations h1 minus h2 by r1 minus h1 of s minus h2 of s by r1 minus h2 by r2 minus h2 of s by r2 is equal to a2 d h2 minus h2 s by dt so when you take these two terms it will be in the form deviation variable so h1 of t minus h2 of t by r1 minus h2 of t by r2 is equal to a2 dh2 of t by dt now taking the laplace on both sides h2 of s h1 of s minus 
h2 of s by r1 minus h2 of s by r2 is equal to a2s h2 of s let's rearrange the terms h1 of s minus h2 of s by r1 is equal to a2s plus 1 by r2 into h2 of s h1 of s minus h2 of s is equal to r1 by r2 after taking the lcm r2 a2s plus 1 into h2 of s h1 of s is equal to r1 by r2 let's take r2 a2s tau2 s plus 1 into h2 of s plus h2 of s as tau2 is equal to r2 a2 equation 2 now take the equation 1 and at steady state qs minus h1s minus h2s by r1 is equal to 0 take the difference between these two equations it will give q of s minus h1 of t minus h2 of t by r1 is equal to a1 d h1 of t by dt applying the laplace on both sides q of s it will be q of t q of s minus h1 of s minus h2 of s by r1 is equal to a1 s h1 of s now substitute h1 of s from the equation 2 here and h1 of h, h1 minus h2 we will get from here now substituting h1 and the difference between h1 and h2 in this equation will be q of s is equal to q of s minus 1 by r2 tau2 s plus 1 into h2 is equal to a1 s h2 of s plus r2 by r r1 by r2 tau2 s plus 1 into h2 rearranging the equations q of s is equal to tau2 s plus 1 by r2 plus a1 s plus r1 by r2 into tau2 s plus 1 into a1 s and the whole of h2 of s q of s is equal to take r2 as denominator and take lcm tau2 s plus 1 plus a1 r2 s plus r1 into tau2 s plus 1 a1 s by r2 into h2 of s as tau1 is equal to a1 r1 so this both will give tau1 q of s is equal to tau2 s plus 1 plus a1 r2 s plus tau1 tau2 s square plus tau1 s divided by r2 into h2 of s h2 of s by q of s is equal to r2 by 
tau 1 tau 2 a square plus tau 1 plus tau 2 plus a1 r2 s a1 r2 into s plus 1 so this is the transfer function for interacting system for non interacting system we have derived a transfer function h2 of s by q of s is equal to r2 by tau 1 tau 2 s square plus tau 1 plus tau 2 into s plus 1 so here a1 r2 is the extra term in the interacting system the presence of this term is due to the presence of interaction so this is the reason for more sluggish response in an interacting system than non-interacting system if you find the response and plot the graph h2 of t versus t non-interacting system will be like this and the interacting system will have more sluggish response so it has a delay than non-interacting system so this is for non-interacting system and interacting system if you like my video subscribe to my channel to get more updates from my channel